Hi folks, welcome back on the water. It's Captain Rod. That sound you heard is the favorite sound of a fishing guide. That's a fish taking drag out while the uh, rod is in the rod holder. It's late fall on Winyaw Bay, and that's been happening a lot lately, thank goodness. Lots of happy customers and lots of fish boated. You know, the year started out on the Roanoke with one of the coldest, wettest springs we've had. Had a lot of folks that were cold and wet. But the last couple of months have been some of the most incredible fishing I've ever known about. We, we started in April and May on the Roanoke, then we came down to Georgetown, fished the tourists from Myrtle Beach in June and July, and then I did something new this year. I went back to North Carolina to the Pamlico Sound. And we caught big red drum on the Pamlico. And probably in 20 trips in 30 days, we just had some awesome giant fish. We left there, came back here, and because we're further south, what we were for there, the spawning run of the big bulls there, when it ended there, it started here. So this past month or six weeks, we've had it right again. Just day after day of big fish boated. It's just been incredible and we'll be here almost through Thanksgiving so I know football's going on and you got lots to do in the fall but honestly this is the best fishing of the year we'd love to have you thanks to everybody who's been with us this year looking forward to doing it again we'll see you at the fishing shows and oh you need to come down everything changes and the Roanoke has not been as great in the last couple of years as it's been in years past but this big red drum fishing, sometimes the numbers are almost as good. And if you catch, you know, everybody in the boat catches two or three of these fish I'm getting ready to show you, you've really, you've caught a trophy fish. Just awesome fishing here, ooh, and on the Pamlico. Can't say enough about that. I want to thank Captain George Beckwith and Captain Greg Voliver for inviting us up there once again. Don't give up on the fishing. There's a lot of fall left. We'd love to have you. Now, let's take a look at this fish. Okay, let's boat him. I don't like to use a net or a boga grip on these fish. They're, they're pretty hardy fish, but still, take as good care of them as we possibly can. So if you just grab them by the tail, actually, get them upside down, they kind of get disoriented, you can pick them right up. Put them right on the gunnel. How about that? Pretty fish, and honestly, that's not a giant one. That's a good size one. He's probably 15, 20 pounds, but we're catching him up to 40 and 50. Really nice fish. Let's put him on the deck. Oh, come here, baby. Okay. Pop that hook out. He's caught. Ah, there you go, folks. Beautiful late fall Winyaw Bay Red Drum. Still healthy. Want to pick them up and hold them by the bottom here so we don't put any pressure on them. Sometimes a fish this big, if you lift them up vertically, the actual weight of their organs will crush into each other and kill the fish. So want to take really good care of them. Some of these fish are 40, 50 years old. So you want to release them so you can catch them a different day. When you release them, you just want to drop them in, make sure they're breathing good. Oh, let's see. Grab him by the tail and kind of work him around. Get some air through his gills, turn him right side up, and there he goes. How about it? We'd love to see you on the bay, Roanoke in the spring, Pamlico in the summer. Just give us a call. This is Captain Ponytail. Thanks for joining us all year long. We've had a great year, fished a lot, sort of learning how to catch them. Have a good one.